PowerPoint Morph Transition is an effective tool to create a beautiful animation effect in your presentation. I have made this beautiful presentation using the Morph Transition, and let's find out how I have done this. I will start with a slide with a black background and insert a circle holding the Shift key. Place the circle in the bottom middle part of the slide and format it with no outline. For this presentation, I have already downloaded a few images. I will insert the first image now and crop the image. Try to keep the plate in the middle so that it fits perfectly in a circular shape. Once you are done with cropping the image, select the image and press Ctrl and X to cut it. Now right-click on the circle and go to Format Shape. Go to Fill and select Picture Fill. Select the clipboard option to paste the cropped image. I will now add the relevant text which I have already prepared. After that, I will insert a rectangle under the heading in the top part of the slide. Format the rectangle with no outline and yellow color. Make the width of the rectangle 0.12 inch. Create a duplicate of the first slide by pressing Ctrl and D or simply right-clicking and selecting. Select the circular shape and in the format, uncheck the box that says Rotate with Shape. Now rotate the circle as you wish. Insert the second image of the food plate. Crop it again like the first one. Once crop, press Ctrl and X. Now select the circle, go to Picture Fill and select the clipboard. Add the relevant heading and description. Select the second slide and create a duplicate of the slide. Follow the same process for the rest of the slide. Make sure to rotate the circle on each slide. This will help to create the morph effect in the slides. This part is important for the PowerPoint animation to work properly. Once all the slides are ready, select all the slides and go to Transitions. Select Morph Transition. Keep the duration to 2 seconds. In the Effect Options, select Characters. This will create text animation. Your slides should be ready now. If you enjoyed the tutorial, make sure to like the video and let us know your thoughts. Subscribe to the channel for more useful content. Thank you for watching.